all about butterflies. Free and wild, free and wild, that's me. I'm a monarch butterfly. Every day I spread my beautiful gold brown wings and fly like a fairy. I visit all my favorite flowers, the asters, the phlox, and the golden rod. I stick my head into the petals and sip up the delicious nectar. Once I get big and strong, I'm taking a long, long trip. But it wasn't always like this. Once upon a time, I was just an egg on a milkweed leaf. After four days curled inside, I cracked the wall of the egg and poked my head out. Now I was a little ca caterpillar. I saw the delicious milkweed leaf in front of me. Yummy, yummy. I eat it, it up. I ate and I ate until I was nice and plump. Now it is time for a very special job. First, I climbed up a branch. Then I hung the upside down. I curled up in a little ball with a hard show around me and fell asleep. It was the coziest time place. After 10 days, I woke up and dot, dot, dot. I was a butterfly with wings. I practiced flying. And I visit my favorite flower to drink their nectar, the acid, the flux, and the goldenrod. And now in September, and the children are going back to school, my friends and I are going on a long trip. We're going to fly away from America. All the way to Mexico, it's 3,000 miles. You think that we look fragile, but we are strong and we are free and wild. We're starting early in the morning. We fly and fly and fly. We see the trees changing their colors. Look at that. Oh, I can see someone delivering the mail to other people. We see the garbage truck pick up the garbage, but we keep going and going and going. But something is wrong. When we stop to rest, we look for the plucks and the asters and the golden rods, but we cannot find them. Instead, we find cars and cement and big parking spots. We're getting hungry and my friend is very tired and I'm afraid he won't be able to keep flying. Help us, I want to shout, but the wind comes to take my words away. We are close to giving up, but now we fly over a little town called Concord. Something very special is waiting for us below. By a creek, someone has planted lots and lots of flowers. Just for us, we fly down and start to eat. More and more butterflies fly out from the sky and land beside us. There are thousands of us. We are all trying to get to Mexico and we all need help and food for the way. I see a sign by the creek. It shows two pictures, one from long ago and one from today. There are lots and lots of changes. More big parking lots and the cement. Less forest and green space. I feel scared. Maybe one day all the green places will be gone. What will my children and grandchildren eat? When our stomachs are full, we rise again into the sky and start to fly. Finally, we fly free and wild over the board to Mexico. Everywhere we see flowers and trees. They cheer us on. Welcome, welcome, tired ones. We're your friends. You'll safe here. We're going to stay in the warm sun of Mexico all winter long. And next year, my children will be back in 
the U.S. I hope that the nice children in Concord will remember to plant many more flowers for us.